ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमाद फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पार्क टेक यूट्यूब चैनल सो टुडे इन दिस वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अबाउट हाउ टू यूज द फंक्शन जनरेटर विद इन दी सर्किट विजर्ट सॉफ्टवेयर सर्किट विजर्ट इज एन ऑफलाइन सिमुलेटर एंड यू कैन यूज इट फॉर टू सिमुलेट एनी सॉर्ट ऑफ यूर डिजिटल एंड एनालॉग इलेक्ट्रॉनिक सर्किट्स सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो क्लिक ऑन virtual instrument and then click on this uh, folder of virtual instrument then after it we can see this function generator here so we need to drag it out after you have done it uh, you must have to take uh, your oscilloscope uh, because function generator used to create or generate different types of waveforms like sinusoidal waves or we can say triangular sato then staircase waves so for it you need to observe the outputs so we will need one oscilloscope okay now we need to connect the positive end of the oscilloscope with the positive end of the function generator and negative end of the oscilloscope with the negative end of the uh with the negative end of the function generator so positive with positive and negative with negative so now we will double click on what's called is the function generator we will change the frequency we can select any type of waveforms like square wave triangular or like a random noise or anything like that okay so we will first click the sine wave uh, we we have selected the frequency to 10 hertz voltage at 5 volt so we will click okay for to observe an oscilloscope right click on it add click on add graph and we will observe the graph here okay so we can make it a little big so we can see it properly so this is our graph okay and this is our oscilloscope so okay now we will run it and we can see that we are getting output on uh, what's called as the uh, oscilloscope so time we have to make a little bit uh, increase in time so uh, we have to i think that this time is per box per horizontal box so let's see that either it will get elongated or not no it is more compact now so again double click on it and reduce the time okay uh, and reduce the time yeah So, okay we can just like uh, okay 1 milli 1 millisecond okay so now hopefully it will okay it's uh, getting very fast now so again we will go and we will go for like a uh, 100 100 milliseconds and now our our uh, what's called as uh, the waveform is okay Okay, double click again on it, and so we will go for like minus twelve to twelve because our uh, signal is having some sort of sine wave. So now you can see properly that our sine waves positive is at five volt and negative is at minus five volt, while its frequency is also ten hertz. So now we will go for to generate uh, uh, any sort of like. Uh, triangular wave so click on okay okay now we will run it and now over yeah it is the triangular wave now we can see that we have generated triangular wave now we will go for random noise and yeah this this is our random noise okay random signal so now can we change the frequency yes we can yes we can change the frequency of any waveform so we can change it to like a uh, 22 of the triangular wave now we can see that our frequency is much more so hopefully you got the concept that how we can use this function generator within the circuit wizard simulator so don't forget to subscribe and thanks for visiting our channel